Hey, hello everyone. Um, so today I'm gonna be going over all my mini bins. So, or well, homemade mini bins. So, here's the first one. Um, so that says number five, but it's reversed on camera. It's got like weird lids that like bubble, which is this is like the first one that I ever made. It doesn't have axles because it's a bit hard. One of them used to have axles but I taped them on so they weren't that good. Here's another one, similar number five. I don't know why I did two fives. I've had these for years actually. Um, Ma, don't know why I wrote Ma on them. Uh, plain old bin right here, it's got a messed up lid. I messed up on cutting it out. Same with the bottom. Um, this one's meant to be like a 120 liter kind of bin doesn't have a it has a lid yeah okay this is an opening one but yep here's the other one this is one that the lid doesn't want to stay open i don't know why so just don't know why it's another 120 liter um one see it's like smaller than this one um okay this one's got a real bobbly lid. So like it's got a lid stock. Like you know how the old American bins used to have like, when they were empty, the lids used to go like that. Like they would stand up. Don't know, it's, it's empty. And here's the best one. Um, this is the one that had an axle in it. This is, came off one of my CLA mini bins. So, it has the best lid action. Lid actually stays closed. You can just flick open the lid. Very durable lids. So, yeah. It sounds like a mini bin too. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, and I've ordered three mini bins. And they should be coming four days, five days, six days, around there. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you um, want something to do if you don't have any bins. So, hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.